Hey, what's up? It's Rich, back with more Silent Hill 3. In the last episode, we explored the majority of um, Central Square Shopping Center, and we got a, a jewel, and now we're going to go bring it to the door, and, and then we're going to do some other stuff. It's going to be great. Um, yeah. So I ended last episode with some speculation about where we might be going from here. It turns out that is where we're going from here. I should have figured there would be a door there. Um, okay. Whoa, whoa, don't you dare fall down there, you skank. And the crickets and the dogs. Okay. Okay. Oh, my God. I'm dead. Okay, let's try that one again. Always, go, well, yeah, I would say generally speaking, always go to the load menu and not through the uh, continue button. Just because um, continues get, like, saved and loads do not. Like, for your, like, final score at the end of the game, it counts how many times you pressed continue, but not how many times you just reloaded the last save. Let's try that again. This time we're going to go left. There's a door. That's a door I've already been in. I'm not going to bother trying to go for that uh, that telephone there. I think there might be a cutscene, but I'm not sure. Doesn't matter. Let's just uh, let's go the other way. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Come on. Uh, don't... There's always, why is there one here? That's like the worst place for one to be. Directly in my path. In a way that I virtually cannot avoid it. Okay, um, now we're gonna go like straight across here. This is actually a bad idea. This room is full of monsters. Yep. Oh dear. Here I'm again. And somehow I expertly avoided every single one of them. Um, okay. I suppose that, uh, is there a save point upstairs? Not one that I know of, so I'm actually, I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to save at this save point. Uh, I'm also going to, I guess, heal. Boy, I am going to have a real hard time <laughs> maintaining my, uh, or like preserving my healing items. I don't know if you can go in any of those other doors there. Uh, the door has a red crescent and a round dent. Something's written here in the same color. Red piling up to 300. Oh my god, do you really? Get up. Get up. Alright, whatever. I guess I can't even pause to read this stupid... Are you kidding? That almost killed me. Kind of may as well just let him kill me and try that again. Wow. Okay, one more time. Pitch. Okay, I have a... Oh my god, please don't get smacked. I have a pretty genius idea here. Oh my god, that was not as smart as I wanted it to be. God damn it. I was hoping I could just cycle through the, uh, the riddle real quick and then... 
put in the stone and get out of here. And then the riddle would get marked up in my memo and I would be able to read it later. Why did he deal so much less damage that time? I don't know, it doesn't matter. He smacks me once and I'm gonna wanna do this. Restart, basically, because I wanna go into that boss fight with as much health as I possibly can. I only have one healing item, so... It is an ampoule, thankfully. I wonder if I'm pronouncing that word right. Ampoule? Like, that's how it's spelled, I just don't know if that's how it's pronounced. Ready? Come on, hurry up. Okay. The trick is pressing B instead of A repeatedly. Nailed it. Okay. This here is the entrance to a boss fight. Can we go in these other doors? I don't think so. Uh, alright, whatever, let's just go. Oh. Bitch, don't you dare fall down there. <sighs> yeah, catch your breath. No, actually don't. You don't deserve it. You don't deserve to breathe. Alright, let's go. What is this setting even supposed to be? Like a parking garage or something? Not exactly, no. Hello, sir. What fine new teeth you have. Man, the freaking monsters in Silent Hill are always like, weirdly kind of sexual. Uh, hey, would you- oh my god. Would you like a bullet, perhaps? He does like them. He wants to snack on them all day! But he cannot snack on me, because I am not on the menu. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is reload through the menu here, just to, you know, save some time or whatever. Oh my god. Okay. What did I hit him, like, twice? I thought there would be, like, a shotgun down here or something. Yeah, you can shoot him like twice, maybe. Oh my god, he's gonna do something crazy, and I am probably gonna die instantly. Ready? Bet. Get ready to die. Where is he? There he is. Whoa, stop that. You cut that out, sir. It's very rude, and he's gonna do it again. No, he's not. Never mind. Know what happens when you assume? Uh, Oops! Oh, does that hurt me? I honestly don't know. No, it does not appear to hurt me. That's good. This guy is not super threatening. Interestingly. We're just gonna let the camera do its thing. Yeah, the camera point you in the right direction. Hello, sir. Oh, shit. 
Get out of the way. No, he's doing this thing where he goes back inside the hole instead of uh, advancing forward. Yeah, we can get about three shots off. Oh my god. This time I guess he felt like advancing forward. Hasn't touched me once though. That's good news. It's a giant mouth slug. Uh, where? Okay. Uh, no. Oh my god. Heather, come on, get your shit together. I want you to go this way. Okay, well, I missed my chance there. That's fine. And he's dead. Wow. That boss is super easy. Okay, and the, um, mall is back to normal, I guess. It's the shopping mall, just like before. <sighs> Am I back? Alright, um, hmm. Now, I do know that there's something in this area that we can check out. I don't remember what it is, or where it is, or if it's worth it, but there's something. Uh, might not actually be in here, though, unless... No, I think it's out here. There's, like, one of these places is open. Uh, the phone doesn't work. Well, we all have our hopes. Okay. Wish I could get a hold of Dad. Eh. You'll be alright. Which one is it? This one? No. Oh, wait, what? The door is shut tight. It won't open at all. It's weird that they have different text for that. Like, the other ones are like, the lock is broken. Something, something, yada, yada. See that one? Can we go in the bathroom? No. The other bathroom? No. What, you mean to tell me I came all the way down here for nothing? Do I have a map of this area? I do. Okay, uh... Oh, right, I want to go the, the... I don't know, check out those other doors. This one. It's this one. I've got a med kit. Thank you. Uh, save points. Bullets. Uh, some stuff. Some things. Some other stuff. Look at that. Beef jerky. And a locked door. Okay. No, okay. Thought maybe there was something else on that table. Uh, okay. Alrighty. Whatever, screw it. I'm going to start just overwriting all these things. Okay. Let us go. That away. Heather! Uh, it's you! What just happened? What you must be one of them! What did I do? 
And what do you mean by one of them? You're in on this with that Claudia, aren't you? Claudia? What about her? She asked me to find you, that's all. So you are one of them? Claudia did all that? Look, I was just hired to find you. I'm not on anybody's side. No, but you I don't are know anything by about them. this. Why don't you start by telling me what happened here? I don't and fucking that know. Monster. What the hell was that? Depends on which monster you're referring to. I don't know to. any more than you do. I have seen many. All I know is that things are getting really screwy around here, and yeah, that's one way to put it. Can you imagine going through all that and be like, "Wow, things me. are pretty screwy around here"? Maybe you're just <laughs> an innocent bystander, but I, I can't feel sorry for you. Cause you dragged me into this. Did he? You know, if you hadn't found me... What are you talking about? What's so special about you anyway? You tell me, man. You're the one who was hired if to find me. I knew that, me. I wouldn't be so confused, would I? But I know there's something. Something I've been running from and forgot for a long time. How did I remember that? What's wrong? Nothing. Where are you going? I'm taking the subway home. What should I do? Hell if I know. Go beat off, man. I don't fucking care. Okay, the subway is generally, like, my least favorite area in the game. And it's actually pretty short, so we might be able to get through here pretty quickly. Um, but I do not like it. Okay, um, alright. So that's like the actual entrance into the subway area. I guess I'm just gonna go around and check all these doors, and then there's some stuff. Yeah. There even like any items lying around here? Anything at all? Throw me a bone here. No, nothing. Have we? I don't have a map. Right. I knew. I knew that. Uh. All right. Screw it. Let's just go inside. Oh, here we go. Um, yeah, so that, like, entry area, I think, is completely worthless. We are now in the concourse. We have three staircases heading down, and a couple of doors at the far side that probably are locked. And then a door that... I don't even think this was on the map. No, it's not on the map. Okay, whatever. Lady? Lady? Hang on, what does that say? Probably nothing interesting. Statue trash, yep. Lady and men. How come lady is singular and men is plural? I mean, you know, look, never mind. Like, why are the doors marked singular and plural? Um, <laughs> good quality, good taste. What even is that? Is that like a sausage? Like, I guess that's like an Italian sausage. 
sandwich with like a bunch of lettuce for some reason. What is that? No, there's there's more going on here, right? Eh. How about this one? Okay, here we go. Just looking for the save point. Pretty sure it's around here. If it's not right here, then it's back where I came from. Except on the other side. Come on, lady. There it is. Okay. Now. We must examine this map. So we can go to platform three and four from here. We got one, two, one and two over there. Another staircase going up. It's hard to determine what these arrows actually mean. Like these ones, you can tell those point up and these point down. But these point right. And I think that still means down. But, like, fuck if I know how to, you know, discern that. Um, okay, let's go this way. What's that? I read this a long time ago. Read what? It's a nothing little occult magazine. Okay, seemed like a bunch of crap to me. It's not so bad if you just read it for fun, though. I thought it was like a storybook, but like a really weird one because it's in a bunch of columns and it has advertisements on the side. Obviously, magazine makes much more sense. Uh, the souls of those who died suddenly by suicide or accident don't realize they're dead. Like, suddenly by accident, I can understand, but by suicide, you would think that they would kind of understand, you know, whatever. Sometimes they stay put and haunt that particular place. These spirits have lost their human senses and memories and can only keep replaying the pain and sadness of the moment they died. Okay. The pain can get so bad that they turn to humans for salvation, or they begrudge humans their lives. At such times, they can possess humans. Places known as famous suicide spots or high accident areas are often to blame. You should be careful when approaching such locations, especially on the day or at the time the death occurred. That is if you don't want it to happen to you, too. Ooh, spooky. Okay, um, it appears that this place has not quite yet been overrun with monsters. First aid kit. A. Hey, um, can I... Uh, you know what? I'm not even going to bother trying to go down on the tracks. There's like one specific spot where you want to do that. It is not here. Um, okay. Alright, so all I can do... Actually, wait a minute. <laughs> Wish I could turn my camera a little bit. Turn the camera? No? Okay. I thought maybe I might be able to jump across to the other side. And it is possible that you might be able to, but I'm not going to try it because I don't want to, like, you know, I don't know, hit the third rail and die or something. Uh, where am I now? Oh, I'm on the, like, weird in-between platform. Okay. All right, uh, I guess we'll go straight over to the other side and check that one out. Bergen Street. 
hey, did she, like, tell me... Oh, you know what? I just remembered something else. I guess it's kind of, like, too late now, but, um... But there was a memo that I wanted to read. Uh, never mind. I guess I don't have it in my memo. The, the moon door riddle or whatever. That should have been saved in my memos, but I guess it wasn't. Um, and... Uh, wherever it is I'm supposed to go, whichever street, like whatever subway train I'm supposed to take here, I have no idea what it is. I'm pretty sure, like, if you look at this, she might tell you, there's a subway map here. Even without looking at this, I still know my way home. Well, I don't. I just need to get on the Bergen Street train at Platform 3. Okay, now I do. And this is Bergen Street. Uh, there's no platform numbers, but, well... There is on the map, though, so I guess that's good enough. Uh, health drink, thank you. Um, okay, why is the camera being a bitch? I don't know. And then this is blocked off for some reason. Bergen Street. just like it's so quiet oh my god finally we found a monster okay and there are a few of them but they don't really mean anything to me that is locked why is that locked hang on let's take a look at the map uh, uh okay there's no marking on that uh that stairwell oh wait it's like scribbled out as if like it's not gonna open I don't know. Maybe it still will. I, I have no idea. You know what? It's great. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Go, 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 go. Around the pillar. Around the pillar, Heather. Come on. Oh my god. Heather, you're the worst. I've taken a poll. The results are in. You are the worst. Seriously. Your mother hates you. These dogs hate you, too. Heather technically doesn't have a mother. Spoilers. <laughs> uh... Wait a minute, what? I want the other thing that brings me to Platform 3. Oh. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> um, okay. So, we have three stairs here that go... They all go up, so they are all just going to go up here. Okay, so I don't care about that at all. So what we want to do is go here, take a left, go through the door. And then there's two to the north and two to the south um, stairwells to the other platforms. Um, so I'm going to be checking those out next time, because we are out of time for this episode. Um, yeah, I haven't gotten any items yet. I've checked out platforms three and four. We've checked out the, uh, the concourse up here. There's nothing going on. I think that was literally just to give me the map. Um, platforms three. Oh my God. Give me a break with all these maps. Uh, three and four seem to be basically pointless. I think what happens is uh, we need to find our way down over here. And then uh, the train pulls in and it pulls in like down here. And so we'll be going through this locked gate to get down to the train and then other stuff happens. I think that's what's happening here. So um, platform three and platform four, the east side are both blocked off. Uh, oops, I didn't really want to close that. I just wanted to zoom out a little. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go down to platforms one and two here. Um, and then we're going to take those down to this thing, which will bring me down to platform three. But of course, a bunch of these are blocked and uh, one of them is locked with like a, I don't know, 
some kind of like puzzle type thing. I don't, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time.